Actor Alec Baldwin told reporters Saturday he is extremely interested in limiting the use of firearms on movie sets in the wake of his fatal shooting while producing his latest film Rust. New Mexico's Santa Fe County Sheriff's Office opened an investigation when a 42-year-old cinematographer was killed on October 21, 2021, after Baldwin discharged a prop gun. The cinematographer, Helena Hutchins, was shot in the chest, and 48-year-old director Joe Souza was also shot and wounded. Baldwin spoke to reporters Saturday, responding to one question by saying he is extremely interested in limiting the use of firearms on movie sets. He said, I do know that an ongoing effort to limit the use of firearms on film sets is something I'm extremely interested in. Baldwin then asked reporters to remember how many guns have been fired on film sets during the past 75 years and stressed that those guns were fired, mostly without incident. However, he added, we have to realize that when it does go wrong, and it's this horrible catastrophic thing, some new measures have to take place. He went on to suggest rubber guns or plastic guns as alternatives to functional guns that normally fire blanks. Hollywood weapons expert Brian Carpenter responded of the Hutchins' death and Sousa's by suggesting Baldwin ignored the number rule of gun safety. The New York Post quoted Carpenter stressing that the number one rule is, loaded or unloaded, a weapon never gets pointed at another human being. He stressed that rules of gun safety apply even on a movie set, where, you never let the muzzle of a weapon cover something you don't intend to destroy.